Hi everyone, Hello, Lens Manoz here. This is episode 3 of Ardent Craft at the beginning. So we left off last time. I was um, working my way through one pushing the right button there, um, jumping on this grinder. Now there was a. Bleh, speaking's hard today. There was a suggestion from Catherine to automate this with a chicken. Now it's you know, so pretty much get a chicken in here and because they jump a little bit it'll it'll automate it um, I tried it with a cow and they don't jump enough although what's interesting is in the um, in the pickle pack series that that pickles was jumping all the time uh, so I thought I'd try it but so now I've got a cow in my house but that's all right I'll use him later uh, only problem with automating with a chicken in this pack is that in this pack they're evil and they chase you and they try and kill you and when you kill them they go uh, demon chicken so potentially I might be able to get one in here and then just throw a fence in the way or something and hold him in there but um, I'm not sure how likely that is because knowing my luck I will die right so I went and did a little bit of mining and I've jumped on that a bunch and you can see in here I've got a lot a few the grits. I don't think I've got everything I need in terms of um, finishing quests, but let's just have a quick look at what we need to get. So the iron one has completed. I only need 32 iron. I'm going to get 8 ingots for that. Mm. If it lets me claim. The, the book's a little bit funny today. Uh, I don't know if it's just my mouse cursor or something's a little bit weird uh, in terms of selection. So at the moment you can see like I'm having to go right to the bottom of the button mm. for it to work. It's it's a little strange. Um, so yeah, not 100% sure what's going on. Steel, no, don't have it. Electrum, no, don't have it. Uh, but we do have... Is there copper here? Ferrous, silver, aluminium, copper. So it wants 64 silver and 64 copper. So let's have a look. I think I've got 64 copper. Eric should do it. Uh, I've only got 28 silver. I need to get some more silver and and mine through that. So quests, started. copper. I'm going to get eight copper ingots. Um, but that's pretty much. I managed to kill two zombies. And I killed a creeper. He did not kill me this time. Really, toy soldier. Yeah. My time already. Goodness me. So I, I, I went and broke a chance cube. Mm. <laughs> and it gave me more chance cubes. Um, anyway, that, that's that's not an issue. So it must it really must be my mouse actually. I don't know whether there's a it's a, a setting or something. Is it one that to do with mouse overlays or something like that, but something isn't quite right. Um I'm really not sure what it is because it's like pretty sure my screen's maximized. It's like I need to be slightly lower than where I want to look. So it's good at that. Uh, okay, so one of the other quests there, what were they? You had one to do gold. Constantine. Lead 64. No, so you don't have that. But Electrum's gold and silver. Mm. What's, how do you make Constantine? See, this, this is the issue. It's, it's actually quite annoying. Uh, that's nickel and copper. So I'd need to get a bit more nickel. We should be able to make that. Uh, I don't think I have any nickel yet. A little bit of aluminium. Uh, pretty much these these ores here, this wolframite, the osmium, galena and cobaltite, will not work through that um, system. So one of the other quests we could do, uh, it's not on this page, I'm still working down to get some uh, redstone, and I've got the sandstone, I've got nowhere near the amount of bricks and clay that I need. Um, so what I was thinking, maybe we'll look at these seeds, and um, I don't think I'm ready for any of this stuff yet. Deep dark portal? Really? Already? Um, 
But in terms of questing, Lorium dust, cyanite, no. I could probably do the tree tap. I'm not sure how to make peat. How do you make peat? Peat, peat. No, that's just bee produce in this one. That's odd. Anyway, that's fine. Uh, seeds, seeds. What was I doing? I was doing seeds. Uh, let's see. Zombie seeds. Or is it seed? I want the infernium ones. Alright, let's just open the quest book and actually see what the thing is I want is. That would be the smart uh, Inferior infernium seeds. Inferior. Inferior. So these are just seeds and infernium essence, which I found a little bit out and about when I was down in the mines. I don't think I've got any in these chests, but there's some seeds. There's oh there, there it is. And I've got some prosperity shards here too, which will come in handy. Wow, that was loud. Thank you, email. Alright, let's make does it just want one of these? I just wanted one. I'm going to get a chance cube for it. I don't want a chance cube. Okay, yep, cool. I'm going to get one for that too. And then it wants us to make an infernium, infernium apple. Okay. I've got some apples. Is that just literally... Same thing? No, I, re I reckon it's blocks. Oh no, it's just four. Cool. We can do that. It's a little bit of absorption. And again, this is just going to give me nothing as a reward. Thanks. Infernium ingot. Okay, let's find out how to make that. Whoop, wrong buttons. Base essence ingot. Iron and Prosperity Shards. Okay. Iron. One Infernium Ingot. Probably wants more than one, doesn't it? I don't know. Cool. So there's a few chance cubes. Uh, so I guess the next one would be Prudent Infernium Seeds. So I'd have to look into how that's made, but um, Prudentium. Prudentium comes from these infusion crystals. So that's a diamond, some prosperity shards, and some infernium. Gives us a crystal. I don't think I've got any diamonds yet. Nope. But I should be able to plant this. Uh, so let's put this stuff away for the moment. I'll keep that on me. But I'll put that in there and that in there and let's go and scare ourselves and do some chance cubes just, just for giggles. Uh, can I get this out? E. Alright. Let's run this way. This could end badly. Could end very badly. So let's do this. Ah! Poisoned. Ah, oh, beehive. I'm getting stung by the bees too. <laughs> I have no food on me either. Get me some stuff. Compass, a clock, and a new iron pickaxe. That's handy. 
really. Thanks, Lucky Blocks. Now I have a piece of bedrock floating in the air. Alright. Well, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to need to do a little bit more mining, but let's go back, head back to base. Ow! Some more food too. Here, little silex. Thank you. Alright, I'm going to cook this up. Crops are coming along quite nicely. Things are um, definitely starting to work for us now. And the lilies are getting there. Bit of rice. Cool. Oh, hang on. Oh, we're here. Okay. Getting a little bit there. Alright. Uh, dumping some stuff off. Probably should take these. And put them in here. But we're getting a nice little uh, amount. Did I not get any silex meat from that fish? It's not very nice. Uh, I put some rotten flesh up here so I could make some jerky. Let's replace the bits that I just took down. Alright. So what should we work on next? We can go dig down and try and find some redstone for this, or I could use some of the. See, this isn't even, this isn't open yet, but I could make a tool forge and start working towards um, a smeltery. I think we're going to need to go and dig down deep. So I'm going to dig the. Eternal mine shaft that I normally do. So give me a few minutes. I'll cut here. I'll get rid of some junk in my inventory, and I'll go on a digging expedition. Definitely need some more food though. So bear with me, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I made it down to level 11. I haven't found any diamonds yet, but I did find some redstone, so that will help us get the next quest, which is that pick. So I need some redstone and I need a couple blocks of iron. So I've got some iron cooking up in here. I'm uh, going to need, no, not that many, but I'm going to need a couple of sticks. So let's make a block of redstone and two blocks of iron. Two of them. Now it's fairly wasteful, this recipe, but I don't know. It's a cool pickaxe. It deletes cobblestone. When you've got that, in, when it's enabled, obviously. So this has a durability of 30,000, which is pretty decent, considering these things have a durability of 128, and that's 250. So this will go for a long time. But, uh, I think there's a chance that weird things spawn with it. I'm, I'm a little bit worried. I've, uh, I'm unsure. Well, let's just have a look. So this is... this wrapper. I'm big to mine them. Okay, so next thing we want to do is make a diamond pick and I don't double beds. Okay. I don't have all that is required for that. I found um, one piece of gold while I was mining. Uh, my, I don't know what I can do with this thing. Nothing. It's it's useless. It's just a decoration. So we can just go. Uh, no, really? I'll place it out in the middle of nowhere. Look, a pile of gold. Woo! Uh, right. So this thing, I've again, I've never used one, but I am a little worried. See that side? Actually, before we did it, let's. Oh, I had some more in here too, didn't I? Wow. Oh. Forgot all about these ones. Got a few bits and pieces. We should be able to make some decent armor, I guess. So let's make. Alright, what was I doing here? Tree tap! One of them. Is that a quest? 
I didn't, I didn't think it was. I want five. What, really? Five tree taps? Oh, I need some more wood too. Be helpful. There's your five tree taps. Goodness me. I get nothing for it. Excellent, thanks. Five rubble saplings. I could have sworn I had a couple of rubber saplings. Anyway, let's go look at them. Some trees up here. We'll go for a walk. See if we can find some rubber trees. Snowy area. Right near the lava, because that's what happens. I was sure I had some rubber saplings. And I was sure that I'd gotten some rubber. So I don't see any more trees around, which is a bummer. I'm going to check through my stuff. I'm pretty sure I've got some. And then maybe we can plant them and bone meal them up. I know we had some. Yoink. Maybe I'm just missing them. Not in there. Not in there. Not in there. Really? Grr. Alright, well I'm going to go and find something because I want to do this next little bit of quest. Um, and to do that, I need the rubber tree. <gasps> I knew I had a rubber tree. Yay! Hey look, zombie on fire. Hey buddy. Take that. So we do have a rubber tree nearby. And I kind of wonder whether it's worth taking the leaves off. I've got a sapling. Got one sapling. I need five. I'm going to get some bone meal. Got a couple of sticky resin. It still wants what does it want? It wants five saplings and it wants a powered tree tap. That's that's a weird starting point to go for that, considering that you know the first thing you're doing is getting some rubber and then it wants something that you need to power, but you don't have the the uh, the resource yet to power it. So that's a little bit strange. Gardens. I haven't really ventured out this way either. So I really haven't done a lot of investigation into what's around me. Um, and I probably should. Because it could be uh, some neat stuff. What was that? Oh, that's one of those, um, I forget what they're called. It's a, a world gen thing from one of the mods, obviously. Uh, let's have a look. It's a chest, though. Nature chest. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Not very nice. Not very nice at all. 
See what I mean about things being evil in this pack? What can I hit you? Ow. Oof. I'm dying. It wasn't very nice of you to just come up and attack me like that. It was very unfair. And now I can't collect all this stuff. Jungle saplings. Dark oak saplings. Magic bean. Uh, you can have some dirt. Cool. What do I do with this? Do I break it? Yeah, nature cores. I don't know what they're for, but you can't break them. And it's night time when I'm outside. But lucky for me, I can do this. Ah. A little bit cheaty, but you can also see I've put mob griefing onto false. Because honestly, really, really, ah. Uh. This, this is an issue. I need to add that mod that allows me to get out of bed. Um, so I'm going to have a look, see if I can get out of bed. There is a way of doing it. Um, I'll be right back. Alright, so the command is basically slash kick me. Um, so that's how I just, it, it, and it pretty much just kicks you off the server. So you got to reload again, but uh, it means you don't have to die, which is cool. So, probably going to use a magic bean if I really wanted to, but. Uh, the other thing you may have noticed, and I sh probably should have referenced it earlier in the episode, is that um, the, the mod that made it so I had to drink water and all that sort of stuff, the, the Hard as Nails mod, has been removed from the pack. Uh, and that was done by the mod author in the latest update. Uh, not sure if it had something to do with vanilla mobs not spawning, but that was the reason for the, the patch. But at the same time, they've removed um, removed the Tough as Nails mod. So that, that's still cool. You know, it just means I don't have to drink water. There's a little bit of a... You know, makes it a little bit easier, but I wouldn't say it's heaps easier at all. Uh, so I guess what we could probably do... And I know it's not in the book, but I don't want to have to jump on that thing all the time. But I don't know if all of these dusts... Because that's just grit. Can we make... Let's just see if it's been changed at all. Crusher? Basic coils, iron casing, red stainier crystal. Yep, so we would need... A coal generator, black quartz sticks, etc. Can I kind of crush this for a start? Let's just have a look. Oh, so I'm just gonna have to smelt it. So let's smelt that down, uh, and then let's make real quick and dirty coal generator. So we need some sticks and some iron. I've got some iron. I've got some sticks. Cool. Um, did I need coal for it? I think I did. Two coal there and then some black quartz. So I grab some of that. Let's make a really, really basic setup here. We want one of them and then a coal generator. Excellent. Um, it's going to go there. And then I want to make. Do, do, do. I'm going to need to make. It's really hard to see at this, this resolution, I think. Maybe that's my problem. I need to make one of these. Atomic Reconstructor. So I need another one of those doobies. Let's grab some of that. Let's grab a little bit more of that and some redstone. And make... I need three more of them. And Atomic Reconstructor. And then I need a redstone torch to be able to change its setting. So let's put, probably should move that out one more actually, let's move the lamp, there 
pretty sure I said do that. Yep, thank you. I can go there for the moment. So let's move you. Should get over one, and then I want that there. I'm stuck in the corner. <sighs> do do do. Kind of wish I could do that at home sometimes. I uh, want to go click, and so then pulse mode. We want to. No, can't do that. I need stone, don't I? I've uh, got some stone in here. Let's make a button. Let's make the button there. Let's get... You know what? Half stack of coal. In you go. Alright, so we've got... This is working. Let's make a real quick... We've got crusher or two crusher. Now, let's just do one. So, basic coil is some redstone here. So, we're going to need four, eight, ten redstone here. So that's just 10 redstone. This isn't going to work. I've got to move these chests. Either move the chest or move this. Because I can't get in that corner. I've got another idea. Let's do this. Alright, and then I'm going to dig up that and put that. And I'm going to put this. Really? That's the way you go. Because I don't have a wrench or anything to turn him around yet. Yep, you there. And then I might be able to put the button here. I'm hoping I can put this there and just to make it look good. Yes, look at that. So let's throw the 10 redstone down there and turn it into redstonia. And then we need, uh, need a few more. I really don't know what it is because of that explosion. Uh, let's see. No, I don't need you. I need a crusher. So I want two of them. Need a couple of flint. Flint, who's got the flint? You've got the flint. Excellent. One actually additions crusher. Like so. It's getting power. Can I now take Weak. Let's see. I don't know whether it counts. It's weird, but I mean, it should count, shouldn't it? So I'm not going to find out until I um need to have a particular amount of something in there. That's that's a little bit silly why it went to that that type. But anyway, uh, and the other thing I probably want to get is one of these, powered furnace. So we're going to need another eight and then a couple of iron in there. I've got two iron. So let's go two of them, eight of them and hit the button. Right. Probably need some more iron. There we go. So let's see, can I make, so I need two furnaces, one, two, two of these, and a powered furnace, excellent, you can go down there, you will now work, awesome. So we now have automated doubling. Um, is chewing a bit of power. These things hold a fair bit of power. Like that one there holds 300,000 RF. So this is going to take a little while to fill that up. And it's probably going to burn through a fair bit of this coal. This is also filling up. Now this is filling up. So, you know, we, um, we're now at a point where we've got 
basic automation. And again, I don't know if this is going to help um, in terms of this sort of stuff. So let's have a look. Uh, aluminium, nickel. I don't really have anything that is going to help me with um, towards my questing. See that one comes out as an industrial craft lead dust, so that's weird. Bone meal, dyes. It's odd that it makes this. I'd like it if it made gold, if it made the grit version, but again, I'm kind of hoping that it will detect that in the book. But again, I don't know. I don't know. We needed 64. It says gold grit, so I don't know if it's. Yeah, it'll be right. Maybe I'll just um, do the stuff that I need because electrum, for example, gold and silver. That's just a case of dumping it all in there and going for gold, and then joining it together. So all it needs a little bit more silver too. Anyway, that's it. Is what it is. So. Got a little bit of basic automation. It's night time again. So let's have a bit of a look in this book. So we're kind of stuck where we are. Um, so I've got to do blast furnace to get these furnaces here. Smeltery, tool forge. Well, I guess. Oh, you need to do smeltery as well for this one. Wow. Alright. Do I have enough stuff to make a book? Because then we'll do this and probably call it an episode. So some rice. Should be able to make some paper. Make a book. Smelt that book. And done. One cooking for blockheads book. So with that, I'm going to wrap up. Thank you all for watching. Please leave your comments in the section below. Come back next time. We'll continue on our quest to uh, get all the things. So thank you. See you later.